If you are preparing for an impressive presentation to your team or to your boss or to your teacher, you may want to add some screenshots of your work to the presentation. In this video, I'm going to show you how to do just that. Let's do it. What's up guys, this is AK. Let me show you how easy to capture screen in Windows and use it in your presentation. To do that, you need to have a word processing software. I use Microsoft Office Suite. Follow the link in the description to get the software. Let's take for example, you need to add screenshot of web pages to your presentation. Now, open the web pages in different tabs in any of the browsers. Check out my other videos on world's safest browser and how to secure your web browser. The first method is to use sniping tool in Windows. Go to start menu and type sniping. Click on sniping tool. The window freezes and let you capture the image. But if you want to reposition your web page, just click on new tab. Now you can reposition the web page and again click on new. By default it will be rectangular snip. But you can explore other options according to your requirements. I will use the default rectangular strip. Now select the area by left click and dragging the mouse to the required position. If you want to modify selection, you may click new tab again and repeat the selection. Once satisfied with your selection, go to the file menu and select save as. Select the format, PNG is my preferred choice and hit save. Now open PowerPoint, go to the slide where you want to insert the screenshots. Click on insert in the menu and select pictures. Select the images and hit insert. You can change image size by holding shift and dragging the corner of the images together. That's it. I will discuss more on modifying images with PowerPoint in the next episode. Let's move on to the second method and it's super fast. Come back to the browsers and hit print screen in your keyboard. Now it will be next to scroll lock in the keyboard. This actually captures the entire screen. Now open PowerPoint and right click and select paste. The entire screen will be pasted. Now to remove unwanted parts from the image, go to format in the menu bar and click on crop. You will get these boundaries. Drag any of them until you achieve the required image. Once done, click on crop to finalize the image. Now you can resize it to fit your to your requirements. That's it in this episode guys. If the video is helpful, kindly subscribe, like and share it with your friends. This is AK. See you in my next episode. Keep learning.